broke his silence following the release of a leaked controversial data, the Pandora Papers. The data links President Uhuru Kenyatta and the first family with 13 secret offshore accounts reportedly worth 3.3 billion shillings. The Pandora Papers link the high and mighty in the world with offshore accounts uh, to hide ill-gotten wealth. However, the leak exonerates President Uhuru Kenyatta and his family from any money acquired from proceeds of crime. Mwangi Maina begins our broadcast tonight. In a statement sent to newsrooms Monday evening by State House spokesperson Kanza Dena, President Uhuru Kenyatta has stated that his attention has been drawn to the ongoing media coverage and the ensuing comments surrounding the Pandora Papers leaks by the International Consortium of Investigative Journalism, ICIJ. While stating that he will respond comprehensively when he returns from his state visit to the Americas, President Kenyatta has in a thin veiled commendation lauded the ICIJ for the report saying it will improve financial transparency. Kenyatta says, and I quote, These reports will go a long way in enhancing the financial transparency and openness that we require in Kenya and around the globe, the movement of illicit funds, proceeds of crime and corruption thrive in an environment of secrecy and darkness, end of quote. The head of state further notes, the Pandora Papers and subsequent follow-up audits will lift that veil of secrecy and darkness for those who cannot explain their assets of wealth, end of quote. The Pandora Papers claim that President Uhuru Kenyatta, his mother Mamangena Kenyatta, his younger brother Muhoho Kenyatta, his two sisters Christina Wamboi Pratt and Anna Nyokambi Kenyatta, secretary owned a network of offshore companies amounting to 3.3 billion. The Pandora Papers claim that in 1999, Mamangena Kenyatta and her two daughters Christina and Anna set up an offshore company, Mildram International Limited, which was incorporated in the BVI according to the ICIJ.